King of lion a huge cat of the species Panthera, the lion Panthera leo is indigenous to Africa and India. Its physique is broad-chested and strong, and it has round ears, a small, rounded head, and a hairy tuft at the end of its tail. Adult male lions are larger than females and have a noticeable mane because they are sexually dimorphic. It is a sociable animal that organizes into prides. Several adult males, associated females, and cubs make up a lion's pride. Female lions typically hunt in packs and target large ungulates as their primary prey. Although some lions scavenge when opportunities arise and have been known to hunt humans, lions typically do not actively seek out and prey on humans. The lion is an apex and keystone predator. The lion lives in shrubland, savannas, and grasslands. Although it is typically more nocturnal than other wild cats, when threatened, it learns to become active at night and during the twilight hours. The lion once roamed all of Africa and Eurasia, from Southeast Europe to India, during the Neolithic era, but it has since been reduced to scattered populations in Sub-Saharan Africa and one population in Western India. Due to a 43% reduction in population in African nations since the early 1990s, it has been classified as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List since 1996. In regions that are not classified as protected, lion populations are unsustainable. The major causes for worry are habitat loss and confrontations with humans, despite the fact that the reason for the decline is not entirely understood. The lion has been widely represented in sculptures, paintings, national flags, modern films, and literature. It is one of the most well-known animal symbols in human culture. Since the late 18th century, lions have been a popular species to display in zoological gardens all over the world. Lions have been kept in menageries since the Roman Empire. Ancient Egyptian art and culture frequently included lions, as did practically all other ancient and medieval societies in the lion's historic and contemporary range. The Latin word lenum nominative, le was borrowed from the ancient Greek word v len, from which the English word, lion, is derived via Anglo-Norman leun. Levi, a Hebrew term, may also be connected. The ancient Greek word, panther, and the classical Latin word, panthra, are the origins of the generic name panthera. When Carl Linnaeus wrote about the lion in his book Systema Natura in 1758, he gave it the scientific name Felis Leo. Lorenzo Cain created the genus Panthera in 1816. Twenty-six lion specimens were described and suggested as subspecies between the mid-18th and mid-20th centuries, of which 11 were recognized as valid in 2005. They could be identified mostly based on the size and color of their skin and manes. About a dozen of the lion-type specimens identified and suggested as subspecies in the 19th and 20th centuries were recognized as legitimate taxa until 2017. Only two subspecific names were used by IUCN Red List assessors between 2008 and 2016, P.L. Leo for populations of African lions and P.L. Persica for populations of Asiatic lions. Based on findings from various phylogeographic studies on lion evolution, the Cat Classification Task Force of the Cat Specialist Group revised lion taxonomy in 2017 and recognized two subspecies, namely, the Asiatic lion, the regionally extinct Barbary lion, and lion populations in west and northern regions of Central Africa are all included in the nominate lion subspecies. Examples of synonyms include P.L. Azondica, P.L. Campsi, P.L. Persica, and P.L. Senegalensis Meyer, 1826. Allen, 1924. It was referred to as the Northern Lion and Northern Subspecies by numerous authors. The extinct Cape Lion and Lion populations in East and Southern Africa are included in P.L. Melanochyta Smith, 1842. There are several synonyms, including P.L. Somaliensis Noak, 1891, P.L. Masaika Newman, 1900, P.L. Sabakiensis Lonberg, 1910 P.L. Blienbergit Lonberg, 1914 P.L. Roosevelt Heller, 1914 P.L. Nyanze Heller, 1914 P. In Northern Central Africa, there does appear to be some overlap between the two groups. In mtDNA-based phylogenies, Central African lions cluster with P. Leo Leo, while their genomic DNA suggests a closer relationship with P. Leo Melanochyta. This suggests that Central African lions are descended from both northern and southern lions. While lions from other regions of Ethiopia cluster with samples from East Africa, lion samples from specific sections of the Ethiopian highlands genetically group with those from Cameroon and Chad. Therefore, researchers believe Ethiopia to be a region of contact between the two subspecies. A historical Sudanese lion sample with wild parents clustered with P.L. 
Leo in mtDNA-based phylogenies, but with a high degree of divergence, according to genome-wide data. Prehistoric times saw the existence of other lion subspecies or sister species to the current lion, a fossil carnassial. Based on the current lion's mutation rate per generation period, the divergence between the modern and cave lion lineages is thought to have occurred between 529,000 and 392,000 years ago. Since there is no proof of gene flow between the two lineages, they did not originate in the same region. At the conclusion of the last glacial epoch, the Eurasian and American cave lions went extinct, leaving no mtDNA ancestors on other continents. During the Middle Pleistocene, the modern lion was presumably widely dispersed throughout Africa, and during the Late Pleistocene, Sub-Saharan Africa saw the beginning of its divergence. When the equatorial rainforest grew from 183,500 to 81,800 years ago, lion populations in East and Southern Africa split off from populations in West and North Africa. They conversed the gene flow between lion populations in Asia and Africa was halted by the extinction of lions in Southern Europe, North Africa, and the Middle East. Lion Samples from East and Southern Africa have more genetic variations than lion samples from Asia and West and Central Africa, which suggests that this group has a longer evolutionary history. A complete genome-wide sequence of lion samples revealed that samples from Central and West Africa shared alleles with samples from Asia, whereas samples from Southern and West Africa shared alleles with samples from Southern Africa. This pattern suggests that after becoming extinct, lion populations in Central Africa were a melting pot probably migrating through the Nile Basin during the early Holocene. Lions and tigers have been crossed at zoos to produce hybrids, either for the amusement of tourists or for scientific research. Because of reciprocal gene effects, the liger is larger than a lion and a tiger, whereas most tigons are smaller than their parents. Lepins are a cross between lions and leopards. The lion is a large, muscular cat with a broad chest, short, rounded head, short neck, and round ears. Light buff to silvery gray, yellowish red, and dark brown are among the colors of its fur. The underparts typically have lighter colors. When a lion cub is born, it has dark spots that gradually disappear as it grows older, though sometimes you can still notice faint marks on the legs and underparts. Only the lion exhibits overt sexual dimorphism among the cat species. Males have larger heads and a prominent mane that covers the majority of their head, neck, shoulders, and chest as it grows backwards and downward. Usually brownish in color, the mane has hairs that are yellow, rusty, and black. All lions have a dark, hairy tuft at the end of their tails. In some lions, this tuft hides a hard, 5 mm long spine, or spur, that is made up of the last, fused sections of the tail bone. Unknown are the spur's purposes. The tuft doesn't exist at birth and begins to grow about 5 plus 12 months. At the age of 7 months, it is easy to spot. Only the tiger compares to the lion in terms of length, weight, and shoulder height among all surviving felid species. The skull is very similar to the tiger's, but it has a slightly shorter postorbital region and wider nasal openings. The frontal region is typically more depressed and flattened as well. The range and habitats of adult lions around the world vary in size and weight. There are reports of a few African and Indian people who were larger than typical. The most recognizable characteristic of the species is the mane of the male lion. In the past 320,000 minus 190,000 years, it might have evolved. When lions are around a year old, it begins to grow. Research has shown that mane size and color are influenced by environmental factors like average ambient temperature. Mane color varies and darkens with age. Mane length is thought to be a predictor of fighting success in male-male pairings, those with darker manes may live longer and have higher child survival rates, however they suffer during the hottest months of the year. A darker, fuller mane is generally regarded as a healthier animal.